hey everyone welcome back to my channel so today i am back with another video and this time we'll be doing a really pretty yet really simple set by using all madam glam gel polishes so the first thing that i'm doing is i'm going in with this holographic silver glitter in the color paradise and it is a gel polish and i'm just going back over it and sprinkling some pink glitter and this glitter i believe was either from walmart or michael's and it's just like a holographic pink And then as you can see, I'm turning the client's finger to make sure that I got glitter all over the nail. And then with my fingers, I'm just gently going back in and just tapping the glitter into that gel polish underneath. And for this pinky, it's going to be all pearls. So I'm going in with this Madame Glam polish in the color Freshman Year. And this one is actually a regular polish from their Gelimentary collection. And this next color is also a gel polish in the color Popsicle. And again, these are all by Madame Glam. And I do have a promo code for them, so I'll leave that in the description. Alrighty, and to clean around that cuticle area, I'm going to go in with this OPI gel brush, but you can use any small brush that you have. I know Alpha Brush has some really good cleanup brushes. I believe it's their French brushes, and I also have a promo code for them, so I'll be sure to leave that down in the description. But we're going to just go ahead and polish the rest of the fingers with this really pretty purple, again, that is in the color Popsicle. And then we're going to cure this hand for 30 seconds, and we're going to do the same thing on the other hand. And to cure the nails, I'm going to be using my Melody Susi UV LED lamp. And we're, again, we're going to cure them for 30 seconds. And then we're going to move over to the other hand. So I'm doing the same Paradise Gel Polish by Madame Glam. I'm going to do that all over the nail. Make sure you kept the free edges as well. And then I'm going to come back in with my glitter. So this is just regular glitter from, like I said, Walmart or Michaels, whichever one. And then I'm just using a cuticle pusher to pick up the glitter and just sprinkle it over the nail and make sure that you turn your client's finger to make sure that you get a full coverage after that i'm just going to dust it off a little bit and then i'm just going to tap around the glitter that way it kind of sinks into that gel polish underneath for the pinky we're doing the freshman year polish by the gelimentary collection by madame glam and then for the rest of the fingers we're doing the popsicle gel polish by madame glam Alrighty, so we're going to cure that one for 30 seconds as well and then we're going to come back and do a second coat and yes they look really good but i always come back and do a second coat no matter no it just doesn't matter i always come back and do a second coat
Alrighty, so after that we're going to go ahead and cure that hand for another 30 seconds and we're going to do a second coat on the other hand too. Alrighty, so after we did two coats, I'm going to go in with my Mia Secret Gel Resin, my wax pencil, and my white pearls. So I'm just doing the same thing that I would usually do if it was bling. I just alternate from the two different sizes. I believe they're the same size as my blink, which would be 3 millimeters and 2 millimeters. And we're just going to fill up the whole nail. Again, we alternate from the two different sizes. I go around the perimeter of the nail, and then I just fill in the center as I go. Alrighty, so I sealed around the pearls with my same glue just to make sure that they stay on really good. And then now I'm just going in with my brush to dust up the glitter nails because it is loose glitter. So you want to make sure that it's not just all over the place. We're going to go ahead and do the pearls on this other pinky. And again, we're using our Mia Secret Gel Resin. We're using our wax pencil and pearls. Alrighty, so now we're going to go in with the IBD gel top coat. And I do want to remind everybody that if you're using loose glitter, you want to make sure that you apply the top coat on that nail last. Because if not, that glitter will be all over your brush. So go ahead and apply the top coat on the nails with the polish. And then at the end, come back and apply the top coat on the glitter nails. And then this will be one of those moments where I say to do as I say and not as I do because as you can see I did the top coat on the glitter but you will see me kind of struggle a little bit trying to get the glitter off the top of the other nails. But if you like dust it off after you apply the glitter and after you cured that you shouldn't have this problem a lot but you still want to make sure you go back and do the um, top coat on the glitter nails at the very end.
Alrighty, so once the nails are cured, we're going to go in with this clear pineapple cuticle oil and just massage it on their cuticles. And this is the final look. They turned out really pretty. They're really simple yet very, very pretty. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram at GetNail32. And I'll see you guys next time.